Hey everyone, a very warm welcome to Novation. This is Shantanu and I welcome you all to the first part of our September 2020 current affairs session. So friends, we are slowly uh, reaching the exam season and I hope you guys are preparing pretty hard. So please uh, keep up with the GK and current affairs also. So in this session also we are going to do very important MCQ questions and uh, at the end of the uh, video you will have some assignments which you should do in the comment section or sath hi sath video ke dauran bhi main aapse kuch questions puchunga to please unko bhi aap answer kariyega okay so without any further ado let's start this session the first question for today what is the name of the remote controlled medical trolley developed by indian railways for covid 19 patients friends the correct answer is c medbot ye uh, ट्रॉली ऑटोमेटेड ट्रॉली रेलवेज ने डेवलप की है आइए जानते हैं इसके बारे में सो दिस ट्रॉली दैट इज मेड बॉट विल हेल्प डिलीवर फूड मेडिसिन एंड कोविड मेडिसिन टू द कोविड नाइनटीन पेशेंट्स सो फ्रेंड्स दिस इज डन इन ऑर्डर टू मेंटेन सोशल डिस्टेंसिंग किसी भी ह्यूमन को नहीं जाना पड़ेगा एक अगर एक रिमोट कंट्रोल मेडिकल ट्रॉली होगी तो और ये कहां पर अभी यूज हो रहा है बेसिकली इट इज यूज इन सेंट्रल हॉस्पिटल ऑफ द डीजल रेल इंजिन फैक्ट्री ऑफ इंडियन रेलवेज यहां पर इसका यूज स्टार्ट हो गया है चलिए आगे बढ़ते हैं Next and another important one, PM Modi has announced which of the following months of 2020 as Nutrition Month. Okay, so the correct answer is A, September 2020. आइए कुछ पीटीएन देखते हैं. So uh, according to uh, Prime Minister Narendra Modi, uh, September 2020 will be celebrated as uh, Nutrition Month, or in Hindi we call it Poshan Maah. Uh, during the man ki baat session and he stated that uh, it will be done in order to increase the awareness of nutrition among children the schools must introduce nutrition monitor next question pm modi has announced which of the following months of 2020 as nutrition month friends the correct answer is september 2020 and let's see the ptn so prime minister modi has announced that uh, september 2020 will be celebrated as the nutrition month or in hindi we call it Poshan Ma in uh, during his Man Ki Baat on radio, and he also stated that uh, this will be done in order to increase the awareness of nutrition among the children. The schools should introduce nutrition monitor or nutrition card uh, in their uh, you know in overall development of the children. Okay, I hope this is clear. Moving forward. India and which of the following country will engage in the bilateral naval exercise Indra? Uh, 2020. So friends, another very important question because uh, military or naval exercises बहुत बार पूछे जाते हैं So आप please इसको note down करिएगा Correct answer is B. Russia. India and Russia are going to uh, you know engage in this bilateral naval exercise. And how you are going to rem uh, remember this Indra? So I and D stand for India here, okay? And R A here is for Russia. That's how you are going to learn this Indra. Okay? I hope this is clear. And uh, PTN. So India and Russia scheduled to uh, hold Indra 2020 in Andaman Sea, close to Strait of Malacca, instead of Indian Ocean region. I hope this is clear. Moving forward, name the first Indian dairy company to be featured in Robo uh, Rabo Ranks uh, Global Top 20 list. Friends, the correct answer is D. Amul. I hope most of you must have guessed it correctly. Uh, let's see the PTN. So as per this list. Nestle which is a Swiss company has topped this list and it has a turnover of around 22 billion dollars and uh, France uh, Lactalis is the second company with 21 billion dollars of revenue uh, I'm sorry turnover and Amul has achieved its annual turnover of dollar 5.5 billion and it is on the position of 16th okay so we are in top 20 with Amul on the uh, rank 16th moving forward Which state has launched the two citizen centric mobile apps Ama Sahar and Swachh Sahar Friends the correct answer is C Odisha Odisha has launched these uh, two apps and uh, so these apps are launched under the scheme of 5T and what is it transparency teamwork technology timeliness to transformation so the under these uh, 5Ts uh, Odisha government has launched these two apps for the benefit of the uh, citizens of the state i hope this is clear friend friends uh, question related to apps are very important so be alert about these questions okay moving ahead what is india's rank in the global innovation index 2020 so friends uh, we are on the 48th position in this ranking for 2020 uh so india has jumped four positions uh, and has now achieved 48th rank so earlier uh, we were on the 52nd position in uh, 2019 Okay, and uh, another important thing is that this ranking is uh, topped by Switzerland, second is Sweden, third is United States of America, 
fourth UK and fifth is Netherlands. So these are the top five most innovative countries and India is on the 48th position. But yes, we have uh, actually improved our ranking. So that's a good sign moving forward. Next is who among the following are included in the Fortune 40 under 40 2020 emerging leaders list. So friends, Ishambani, yes, uh, she is there. Other Poonawala, yes. Uh, Baiju Ravindran, uh, Ravindran, yes, he is also there. So all of these are included in this list. Let's see the PTN. So Fortune 40, uh, 40s under 40 is an annual list of influential individuals under the age of 40. So from the name, you can understand uh, under 40 means those who are under the uh, age of 40 years. And uh, in it, Reliance Jews, Isha and Akash Ambani both are there. Edutech company founder Baiju Ravindran is also there. And Serum Institute of India, Adar Poonawala, he is the CEO of Serum Institute of uh, uh, India, Pune. He is the CEO of that company. So he is also in the emerging leaders list. Moving forward, which state government has launched the I Rakhwali app? Friends, correct answer is A, Punjab. So Punjab ne wala app launch kiya hai, iske baare mein hum dekhte kya hai. So the application has been developed to ensure greenery and to protect the environment in Punjab. And its main aim is to ensure people to plant more and more trees. So friends, now here I have a question for you. Please quickly tell me the name of the chief minister of Punjab in the comment section. Okay. And since this is a question related to app, please uh, be alert. This is an important question. Moving ahead. As per the report released by non-governmental uh, organization, mobile crutches, which state has stopped in terms of care for child? Bacho ki care ke liye kaun sa state number one aya hai according to mobile crutches? Friends, correct answer is D. Kerala. Chali dekhte hai ye uh, jo list banti hai ye kin factors se influence hoti hai. So, first let's see the states which have topped the ranking. Kerala, Goa, Tripura, Tamil Nadu and Mizoram are the top five states for the well-being of children. Uh, friends, is mein kya measure kiya jata hai is index mein? It is uh, the health of the child, nutrition and cognitive growth with the help of indicators such as infant mortality rate, stunting, stunting yani ke choti height hona bachcho ki and net attendance at the primary school level. So, in teen se uh, jo parameters hai, uske basis par unko rank kiya jata hai aur usme top kiya hai Kerala ne. Chali aage badhte hai. India now has the dash largest node, uh, road network. Friends, the correct answer is C. Second, so we have the second largest road network in the world. Let's see the PTN. So uh, the Minister for Road Transport and Highways, Mr. Uh, Nitin Gadkari, he informed that now India is having second largest uh, road network. And one more important thing he informed that uh, presently on an average, uh, the current rate for road building is around 30 kilometers per day, very important figure. And the highest which we have actually reached is 40 kilometers per day. Uh, for the construction of highways. So please keep these uh, figures in mind. Uh, moving ahead, Vodafone idea, very important question. Vodafone idea has unveiled a brand new identity recently. What is the name of the brand now? So friends, uh, this is very important question related to business awareness. So please uh, do watch my business awareness series. Uh, there will be a lot more uh, business related questions in that series. I'll put its link in the description section and also on the top right corner of your screens. So here the correct answer is V. You must have seen the ad, they are advertising, you know, ex expending a lot of money on uh, advertisement. So over the last two years, the telco maintained its two different brands. So now, these Vodafone and Idea were divided, the brand ko unhone divided. Hi rakha tha. But now, uh, in order to gain more subscribers, uh, they have said that they are going to merge Vodafone Idea and make a new brand, V. I hope this is clear. Aage According to the recent report of National Statistical Office NSO survey, which state has emerged as the most literate state in India? Friends, this is a no-brainer. I hope you all know that Kerala is the most literate state in our country. Chali, PTN hai. So Kerala has a you know humongous 96.2% uh, literacy rate. This is this is very impressive, I would say. And last me agar dekha jaye to last me aaya hai Andhra Pradesh. Uh, it's in bottom with 66.4% literacy rate and Rajasthan is the second worst performer. You don't need to remember all these uh, percentages. Just keep it, uh, uh, you know, keep some at least top uh, two and top three in mind. So Kerala uh, and bottom is Andhra Pradesh and Kerala is on the top. And uh, the ranking continues like Bihar, Telangana, Uttar Pradesh and Madhya Pradesh. These are among the, the, the trend is basically increasing. Okay, so you can read uh, more about it. Uh, we'll move forward. India is, uh, what is India's rank in Global Economic Freedom Index of 2020? Friends, uh, this is a decimal ranking. Our ranking is 
105th let's see the ptn so the country was ranked 79th इन 2019 इकोनॉमिक फ्रीडम इंडेक्स में पहले हम 79 पोजीशन पे थे पर अब 2020 में हम लोग पिछड़ चुके हैं वी आर ऑन 105th डिसमल पोजीशन आई वुड से सो व्हाई बिकॉज दिस रैंकिंग बेसिकली मेजर्स इकोनॉमिक फ्रीडम और द एबिलिटी ऑफ द इंडिविजुअल टू मेक देयर ओन इकोनॉमिक डिसीजंस इन द कंट्री बाय एनालाइजिंग पॉलिसीज एंड इंस्टीट्यूशंस ऑफ देयर कंट्री सो Uh, क्या लोग अपने आप अपनी इकोनॉमिक डिसीजन ले पा रहे हैं अगर भारत की रैंकिंग देखी जाए तो बहुत कम है यानी कि वी आर स्टिल लैगिंग बिहाइंड अ लॉट वाइल टेकिंग आर ओन इकोनॉमिक डिसीजन सो गवर्नमेंट शुड वर्क हार्ड ऑन दिस फैक्टर ओके लेट्स मूव फॉरवर्ड हु अमंग द फॉलोइंग बॉलीवुड स्टार्स हैज बीन अपॉइंटेड एज द चेयरपर्सन ऑफ नेशनल स्कूल ऑफ ड्रामा मतलब इंपॉर्टेंट क्वेश्चन द करेक्ट आंसर इज ए परेश रावल परेश रावल हैज बीन अपॉइंटेड एज द चेयरमैन चेयरपर्सन ऑफ नेशनल स्कूल ऑफ ड्रामा and uh, when important thing about parish rawal is that he has won national film award for best supporting actor in 1994 and was also awarded padma shri in 2014 aage badhte hain name the first american cricketer to join ipl 2020 so friends another interesting question kyunki aap logon ne dekha hoga america is not that much into cricket but slowly uh, they are nurturing uh, their cricketing talent and uh, the correct answer is a ali khan so ali khan will be playing ipl 2020 and uh, he will be in kkr that is kolkata night riders okay and he is an american usa basically from usa moving ahead unicef india has roped in which of the following people as its celebrity advocate for children's right uh, free ca- campaign for every children friends very important one jab bhi aapko advocate ya fir ambassadors type question mile please be alert they are very important so unicef has roped in aishman khurana as their uh, advocate for children's right for every children let's see the ptn so uh, aishman will uh, support unicef towards its work around ending violence against children so violence jo bhi bachcho ke prati kiya jata hai usko khatam karne ke liye ye abhiyan chalaya ja raha hai chaliye aage badhte hain next question which state has launched the scheme garima to ensure safety and uh, dignity of uh, core sanitation workers of the state friends i would say this is a very important question you can see it in one of the exam i'm very sure so uh, the correct answer is c again odisha odisha has launched this garima scheme so jaisa hi question mein samajh mein aa raha hai dosto ye sanitation workers ke liye ek program hai ek policy hai ke wo acche se safely aur dignity ke sath apni life bita paaye chaliye ptn dekhte hain so this app will register and identify core sanitation worker and it will provide uh, them uh, various uh, services like it will provide them necessary machines and appropriate personal protective equipments because hame pata hai kai log jo bhi manual scavenging karte hain ya sanitation workers hote hain उनको वो कई कई बार फ्रेंड्स दे हैव टू लूज देयर लाइफ वाइल क्लीनिंग दोस फॉर अस सो दिस इज अ वेरी यू नो इट इज इन आर सोसाइटी इट इज कंसिडर्ड अ अनडिग्निफाइड जॉब बट स्टेट ऑफ ओडिशा हैज लॉन्च द स्कीम टू प्रोवाइड दैम दी सैनिटेशन वर्कर विद अ गुड लाइवलीहुड अ गुड रेप्यूटेबल लाइफ बाय प्रोवाइडिंग नेसेसरी मशीन्स एंड वेरियस पी पी किट्स सो दैट दे कैन सेफली वर्क इन देयर वर्किंग कंडीशन आई होप दिस इज क्लियर आगे बढ़ते हैं Who among the following won the 2020 US Open's uh, single title? Women's single title. Friends, very important question related to sport. And the correct answer is C. Naomi Osaka. Naomi Osaka is from Japan, and uh, she won w- by 1-6, 6-3, and 6-3 against uh, Victoria Azarenka, who is uh, from Belarus, and she won the uh, women's title for 2020 US Open. Moving ahead. Which of the following union territories announced a health scheme intended to provide universal health insurance cover to all of its resi- uh, residents? Friends, the correct answer is C. Jammu and Kashmir. Jammu and Kashmir is going to provide a universal health insurance to all of its citizens, and this scheme is going to cost around one twenty three crores to the central government. And चलिए आप मुझे जल्दी से बताइए कि Jammu and Kashmir के governor, uh, lieutenant governor कौन है? Okay, so please tell me in the comment section. Okay next uh, which of the following is the first country in the world to impose a second national coronavirus lockdown in the country so uh, friends correct answer is d israel so initially they had a lockdown but uh, then uh, they opened it and now again they are going to impose a lockdown so the correct answer is israel Uh, despite the early successes in stemming or stopping the virus spread protests have been uh, broken out as cases have risen against Netanyahu and the government handling of the 
pandemic so uh, they they have not handled it properly according to its citizens and that's why they are protesting against against uh, benjamin netanyahu who's the prime minister of israel moving ahead next is who has been recently re-elected as the deputy chairman of rajya sabha the upper house of parliament the correct answer is a harivansh narayan singh and he has been re-elected so he has become the uh, deputy uh, chairman of rajya sabha the second time and he belongs to janta dal united party okay uh, that is he is from nitish kumar's party okay so now we have come to the assignment section you have to tell me which state unveiled the first heritage tourism policy and according to this policy the state is going to allow opening up of heritage hotels museums banquet hall and restaurant inside historic palaces forts and buildings so please tell me the name of the state next who recently won the us open मेन्स सिंगल्स टाइटल ऑफ ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी सो हमने वेमेन्स सिंगल टाइटल डिस्कस कर लिया है आप लोग मुझे बताइए मेन्स टाइटल किसको मिला है यूएस ओपन में ओके सो फ्रेंड्स वी हैव कम टू एन एंड टू दिस सेशन एंड आई होप दीज सेशन आर हेल्पिंग यू एंड यू गाइज आर कीपिंग अप विद द करेंट अफेयर्स बिकॉज दिस इज गोइंग टू बी द मेक और ब्रेक सेक्शन फॉर एनी एग्जाम दैट यू गोइंग टू टारगेट ऑलमोस्ट ऑल दी एग्जाम्स ओके So friends, uh, I'll please uh, ask you to please like the video if you've, if you have liked the content and share it with your friends and subscribe to Novation for more awesome uh, videos on GK and vocabulary. So friends, I'll see you next time with another awesome video. Until then, bye bye and please take care.